Hello everybody and welcome back to our Denica playthrough in the E4 Ambin Armand. Last episode we kicked the shit out of the dwarves over here on the east. Took some rightful clay over here. Now we're just gonna clean up the rest of it. Pretty much immediately. Looks like the blade marches are gonna join, but they are a shadow of their former self. They <laughs> took refuge in the deep woods over here. So yeah, it's just clean up Marhold and the rest of these guys, and we'll have all of us gone to ourselves. Let's go. Let's get you over there. Oh, we also need the core all this. Silly me. Just tell him. Doing work. And look at that, he's just trapped. What are you gonna do? Blade marchers are pretty much already out. I can force religion on them, which is hilarious. I forgot they're Coronite. Yeah, even though they have Fey Court provinces. <laughs> oh my lord. Yeah, this is pretty much an easy war. I'm just gonna take all this. Goodbye. Villian Zelts there. And I'm gonna shave a couple troops off of these stacks. I'm gonna make it a, um,. An 18, 18, and so it meets 36 once we, the combat with it comes out, so. Even though we don't really need the min-max at all, it doesn't really matter right now. We can pretty much destroy anybody. Let's take these guys out. And then all we're gonna have left is S still over here, and our truce is gonna run out Pretty soon. Alright, goodbye. Give me war reps. Take away all of these cores you have on me. So if we somehow lose a coalition, you can't get it back. Awesome. Come this way. Mar holds down and out. It's time to conquer them. They don't want it yet. Yeah, that's fine. I like the, how they actually have a say, even though it really doesn't matter. You're pretty much gone, kid. There you go. Goodbye. And then let's clean up this stack. Boom. Almost perfect. Basically my motto for this game. Alright, and then we have just you left. Let's take you out. Start coring these. Oof. I'll go into debt, why not? And it will start revoking some of these. I might get rid of the nobility. I don't know. I think I might just keep it because of, you know, lore reasons, but... Hmm. If we did... We would still be able to keep a hundred army tradition, so I might as well just do it. It's time to become more absolute. We are a a knight emperor. Yeah, there goes that loan. Well, it's been a while since the Northmen have revolted. I'm actually very surprised. I think of the court and country disaster too. Hmm. You are now down. Good. That's pretty much it there, and then let's wrap you guys around. Funny enough, out of all my hours of playing EU4, I have never done the um, the court and country disaster. Hmm, I don't know how it works. Let's get rid of that. So since Iskand's going to be cleaned up, I got to figure out what I'm going to do next with the Empire, and I'm thinking. Well, half orc mercenary company. I don't take kindly to mercenary companies. Oh, there goes paper. Paper's now dead. Thank you, Peter. So I'm thinking, yeah, I said I was going to declare on Weston, but I don't know if he's small enough to uh, fully convert him. Maybe if I get my absolutism up, I could. Yeah, mortal court doesn't help at all here. 
and strengthen the government. Oh, glass just got nuked as well. Thank you, Silverforge, for doing that. Yeah, let's see. Yeah, Mortal Corps is minus five. Trade rights. Basically, the partisans over here. Hmm. The adventurers as well. Wouldn't even make them licensed. Interesting. Can actually do this as well, too. Help out with that. Summon the Diet. I'm not colonizing. <laughs> yeah, let's take care of these guys. Not too bad. Just particular risks don't really matter that much. When does your truce run out? It's been run out. Okay, good. We are going to lose some of that land, but that is fine for now. Yeah, we're still at 45%. Take out these guys up here. I mean, all these are basically fortified anyways, so it didn't do anything. And it was Cugs Road. I thought it said train station. No, a trade station. We'll get that done when we're able, but let's focus on you instead. The Rot Wall. Oh, thank you, Printing Press. Good news, everyone. Alright. So once we get the, uh, the country stabilized, we will see what to do next with the Empire. We are going to possibly get this. Court and country. I still don't know what it does. I'm assuming it's nothing good. How's it looking over here? Let's get some rebel suppression. In the name of freedom. There you go. We are actually losing money now. Yeah, look at that fort maintenance. is sky high. I love that movie. Um, let's see. What are some good states? Old Haven. Can afford to get these. Oh yeah, I remember you. It's really expensive, but it will help out in the long run. Eben Mark. Eben Mark. Right, that's fine for now. We are now at... 196. Oh, 329. Yep, we're over it now. Fine. More orc slavery dwindling due to the ban. Old Mirwood's just gonna change to something. Guess we'll wait and see. Copper. Eh. Eh. Actually, what am I doing? I'm supposed to be taking out Esso. What's going on, brain? Yeah, we're still focusing on Adam and Good. Excuse me, I am a little sick at the moment. Oh, God damn it. You go there. I know you're on rebel duty, but that's fine. Actually, I just catch him off guard and just wipe him in the carpet siege. Got some uniform regulations that will help out with cloth, wool, and dyes. Let's go. Silverforge is bitching out. Terra and Sestron will join, though. I wonder. Sistrond is a heretic. He is allied with Westham, but if we make him a co-belligerent, then that would be stupid. So, yeah, let's not do that. Say goodbye to your army. Full stack mode. Let me just go like... Hopefully this works out. And just like that, they're done. <laughs> Gotta love it. This is what old EU4 used to look like. Kinda miss those days. 
Especially when you would be so cocky and sieging everything down and then people would just arrive with a giant stack and just wipe out all of your carpet sieging armies. It's perfect. Well, I'll take that. We are actually maxed out on bird mana here. Maybe I could get some good provinces going up here. See, so cost... I do need some of these to be 40 dev, so I could do that as well. Want to get the cats and all built up. Yeah, that's fine. Take the next quality idea, morale of navies. I still don't know what a boat is. Maybe we'll build a navy soon. But I do want to wipe out all Evelyn, because I think they are constantly raiding us over here, which is hurting our economy. Think about the economy, fools. You go through there. Who else is at war? You. Ha! How's that feel, sieging down your Pope? God, I love how he's over little vassal. <laughs> I'll wipe him out. Oh, come on. You can handle your own rebels, right? Actually, they're gonna flip to the skewer Drake. Where are they at? Did the skewer Drake get all the way over here? What? I don't understand most of the time. Makes no sense. Anyways, Terra is out. He's okay. Just give me your lunch money. Let's get you in here. Wonder, can we actually convert you? We cannot. We're so close, though. Come on. Hmm, actually... I'm thinking. Yeah, we are at max absolutism. Damn it! Is there any other way we can reduce this? Expelling goblins. You know what? I changed my mind, goblin folk. You can stay. Now is that enough? <laughs> Hold on, our administration is... Cannot handle all this, so we can convert this guy, apparently. Let's stop expelling goblins, of course. Oh, look at that. Thank you for the money. Pay off my debt. Let's see. 102%. We're so close. And the more we convert, the higher it will get as well. So hopefully we can get there. There goes the clergy. Thanks. I hate that event so much. I get it, the clergy hates me, but come on. Awesome, and I can't even go back unless I get black flagged. Damn it. It's alright, we can deal with them. Get you over here. Yeah. Clergy absolutely... Is disgusted by me. Hmm. Let's see. We can change these over. Like Adventurer's Guild. We can change them. I think it's worth it. I'd rather take taxes. Yeah, let's do that. And then bring that back up. I know, it's ridiculous, but it's what I want to do. 101%, <laughs> please. I'm begging you. Just give me the conversion already. What else can we do? I can promote this. Can force some of these down. It's pretty expensive though. Maybe you. 
that's 68. Okay, we're almost there. Just need to fully siege them down. We gotta get to the magic absolutism number. Nice army fun. Army fun, look at that. Wiped immediately. Say goodbye to your stack. Put you over here. A leader just died, that's fine. We'll just get Alan the Kind. I don't know what it is with the Denikins and kind people being amazing generals. But anyways, a 99% conversion. Amazing. A glorious victory over here. Honestly, a good war in general because now I think we can get all of this. 63%. Thank you for this amazing CB. If we didn't have the CB, we wouldn't have been able to do it. And now we're one step closer. Finishing this off. Look at that. What a glorious name. Super expensive. Definitely gonna be... Damn it, that sucks. Definitely gonna be hurting on all of our admin stuff, but that's fine. We can deal with it. Our magical mana points will come back. Do I really need to fight you over this? Apparently so. Honestly, we just need to relax for now. Take this. Yeah, that's fine. Just revolts right here in the middle. I'll have you take care of this. Here, you can take care of all of it. I don't really care. It's your job and your job only. I'm gonna have everybody else drill, because I do want to make my military even better. We're not fully professional. We will get there. Almost done coring all of it. Nice. I am going to go through one day and f configure all the trade stuff, but... Oh lord, there's so much. And people just keep converting back. Really need to wipe out the center reformation so they just stay. But look at this disgusting western block of rebellionism right here. It's terrible. I hate it. There are 31 heretics in the Empire itself. Look at that, 35% admin efficiency. It's only going to get better. There goes that last province. And I actually want to look into getting these special buildings. Build the Grand Bazaar. Lower Kassanath needs 40 dev, 15 production. Trade Depot... Hmm. It's 40 dev. Trade Depot. I think that's all we need here. Right? Trade Depot, Stock Exchange, Workshop, Counting House. Okay, yeah. Let's get there. We can get the Grand Bazaar getting up there. The Splendful Court. North Castanoff needs a cathedral and a courthouse or a town hall. Hmm. I forgot I was having you on there. Courthouse, cathedral. Yep, yeah, there we go. And then South needs something else the Dragon Forge. 40 dev, 15 manpower, training fields, and regimental camp. So we need that. Yeah, we'll see. We're actually getting close. I want to get this little trifecta of wonder buildings, I guess. Who needs 40 dev again? You do. You need it as well. Just, we're just lacking so much on admin, but we can just get this one done. And good stuff. Alright, with that, I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.